The patient was diagnosed with a figure 1 type 5 droid and the stroscopic myomectomy under general anesthesia with endotracial intubation positioned in lithotomy with a Trendelenburg tilt. Intraoperatively, a single well defined submucosal fibroid, approximately 4x3 segment size, was identified. No evidence of excessive bleeding or other structural anomalies. After patient preparation, including visualization and stabilization of the cervix with the tenaculum, cervical dilation was performed at up to Hagar size 10. A 4 mm continuous flow hysteroscope with a 30 degree lens was inserted into the uterine cavity using saline as the distension medium at a pressure of 350 mm. The fibroid was located protruding to the uterine cavity without deep myometrial invasion. A bipolar resectoscope was used to resect the fibroid layer by layer, maintaining continuous irrigation for clear visualization. Hemostasis was achieved using bipolar energy settings at 45 with minimal bleeding controlled by electrocautery and irrigation. Final inspection revealed a clear uterine cavity with no residual fibroid tissue or abnormalities and the endometrial cavity was intact with no perforation noted.